Center for Rational Catalyst Synthesis, or CIRCUS, is a National Science Foundation sponsored industry university consortium which allows us to bring in uh, different sets of expertise at, at different universities and, and our company members uh, to study some of the fundamental issues in, in heterogeneous catalyst synthesis. Catalyst preparation has been called a voodoo uh, science. You have to use the right incantations and spells to get the, uh, the right formulation. And so our goal in the Center for Rational Catalyst Synthesis is to turn the art of catalyst preparation into a science. The work I'm doing in Circus involves uh, trying to explore the synthesis of uh, catalysts using uh, new methods. And I've had a number of projects over the years, uh, ranging from trying to make supported nanoparticles to our current project, which is involved in trying to make supported single atom or isolated atom catalysts. By isolating the atoms on the support, we hope to achieve a number of, of goals. First, we hope to have well-defined active sites where the reaction occurs. And then in addition, we hope to be able to get some unique catalytic activity in the very stable heterogeneous catalyst. Our founding partner was Virginia Commonwealth University. And to the expertise at the University of South Carolina at the synthesis of supported nanoparticles, uh, VCU has contributed lots of pharmaceutical applications. Most pharma processes are, are, are carried out in batch reactors and they're, uh, they're very labor intensive and uh, they generate very large amounts of waste. With these catalysts that we've developed for cross-coupling reactions, these sodium and graphene catalysts, we could develop a packed bed of the catalysts that we could just push the starting materials through and collect the product out and not have to worry about it, uh, about contamination or impurities. The opportunity to collaborate is um, a really important aspect of not only what we're doing in research, but the mission of Circus. We've recently been joined by the University of California at Davis and Berkeley as a joint third site, and they have contributed tremendous expertise in zeolites and metal-containing zeolites. What we're doing is we're bringing a lot of people with complementary viewpoints together to think and figure out things to try and, and make these materials, these catalysts, with various different methods. The, the whole concept is we do academic you know, fundamental research that's driven by technological need and opportunity. It makes for a very invigorating research environment and community, uh, fostering the exchange of ideas, shared instrumentation that would really be impossible to do in any single lab. And we've benefited from that greatly in our project dealing with CO2 sequestration under humid conditions. This idea of catching a material in the presence of water introduces technical aspects of the material itself changing during the adsorption event. Our goal is to use that to our advantage to be able to satisfy the challenge that's facing us in this area. The industrial participants in the center uh, like to see the fundamental research, and we're actually able to save our company members of substantial funding uh, to do the research that they would otherwise do in their own shops. Some little tidbit that they're working on, some little finding, discovery, new direction, we can take a piece of that, bring it into our labs, apply it to a particular program that we're working on and get a really good lead into some new technology or a new way of doing things. It, it brings new and fresh ideas into us, plus we're exposed to, you know, ideas that we don't normally run into. We're exposed also to some very good young students. The students and, and postdocs also like the practical applications and it gives them something extra put, to put on their resume. We work with the industry members to focus the scientific problems on challenges that they're facing and, and challenges that are relevant to them. It focuses so many different perspectives onto a single problem and, and gets people excited about the same problem. But potentially even more valuable has been the experience working in these teams and the exposure to a wide variety of situations including 
multiple universities and, and multiple research groups within even just UC Davis, but then also with the folks at various national labs and in industry. And it's been one of the defining experiences in my PhD. The Center for Rational Catalyst Synthesis is a wonderful place for people to develop new ideas and to cultivate new ideas. The unique community that Circus brings together really provides a very fertile exchange of ideas and learning environment, I think, for everyone involved. We're helping move the science forward. We're helping people get educated as part of that, and it, it's, it's all hand in glove fit. The real challenge for growing and sustaining the organization is to make sure that we have uh, not only uh, more partners, but willing partners that want to participate and, and act, be actively engaged in the work that we're doing together. The ultimate goal is to turn the art of catalyst preparation into a science. We hope to contribute to that effort.